happy little gooch, don't you see? A great big dog's the only one for me. Then I'll be doing all right. Well, I got him back when he was just a pup. Way back then, I could pick him up. Now he barely fits into my pickup truck. Yeah, but he's doing all right. And it's a great day stand, six foot five. Feel his cold away. I don't know, Finn. Well, now you see it? Oh, there's two. They could care less. They know all about these dogs. Yeah, we hear you, Magic. And so I've just been grabbing little clips throughout my day with the Great Danes as we work from home, Thursday in week seven. It is now noon. I just finished a conference call, and for the last five minutes, uh, Magic was right here in my Microsoft Teams video conference because he wanted something to eat. Do you want to eat? Are you ready? Sit. Good boy. I love you so much. All right, we're going to get one scoop, and it's not even a whole scoop, guys. We just kind of give it this. And I've covered this before, and I'm not sponsored by it at all, but this is from Simple Human. It doesn't quite hold a 34-pound bag, but it's a great, great container. Oh, uh, how are we doing? Are you ready to eat? What do you think? Oh, bubbles and everything. There you go, buddy. That's a pretty paltry offering, I apologize. So just finishing this out, the handle is magnetic, which is great. It goes right in here, simple human, boom. And that's pretty nice, and it's also on wheels if you need to move it around. Okay, Finn nowhere to be seen because he's not that interested in food. Again, we've got magic in the morning here, just loving the heater. I had to kick him out for a conference call this morning. I had to kick him out for a conference call this morning, and they went upstairs and just did nothing but bark, and I could hear my wife and daughter yelling at him. The only way they're happy is if they're down here with me. At one point, I had Finn down here and Magic upstairs, and Magic started whining terribly, and then Finn started whining down here. It was so cute. They have to be together. And I don't know, are you guys seeing the PowerPoint again? Not yet. Oh. Okay. Uh, this is so much fun to be used to this. <laughs> if I didn't always have like 15 PowerPoints open too, that would probably help. You can help. Hey guys. It's the beginning of week eight. The dogs are in their places, and life is good. Someone's in his favorite spot. I love the little crooked paw there, Finny boy. He's got a bowl full of food sitting back in his house. It's 6.05 in the evening, and he has no desire to eat it. And my main job is to keep magic from eating it now. Finn says, just give me the sun. End of another long, hard work day, and all I want to do is lay in the sun. It's good to be a Great Dane.
We have uh, really been trying to be strict lately on Finn and just knowing how to draw the line. And, and when I say something isn't going to happen, um, we just don't let it happen. We, we lay down the law. We're consistent about our... Tr Finn, what are you doing on the couch? Oh, my God, get down. What are you doing? Get down. No, no, no. I had a weak, weak moment, and he thinks he's good. I, I don't want him on the couch, but that was cute. Hey, we're just hanging out here. It's 9.15. We've been up here for an hour and a half. I was down working earlier after dinner just for a brief amount of time, and the dogs had to be with me. When I came upstairs, Magic finally came up and laid down. Good boy. But Finn, he wouldn't come upstairs, and so let's just see. Once again. If you're only allowed on one couch, well then, you stay on that couch. Finn, you're so silly. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Now you joined us. Ah, you're back amongst the living. Good job. And fur. Great athletic dog. All around farm dog. They even use them to hunt big game in Africa. Look at. Some people think this dog might have otter hair. Probably should look a little bit scruffy. This dog looks pretty good. <laughs> Michelle's Here's a great looking Karen Terrier, Dave. Karen Terrier's. Ready? Oh!